You like that? That's awesome. I love it. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Spawning in the bottom right corner of GSL's Warwind, we have the Pink Zerg. STN! <laughs> <laughs> and in the top left corner, we have our red Zerg, Zerg Prince. Hope that was okay. Yeah, that was. Good. <laughs> Mind the games. Mind games. Mind games is when you fake an all-in expansion, and then you all-in anyway. <laughs> you fake an all-in, and then all-in anyway. That's a mind game. Um, so, nothing too different yet. They're doing the exact same thing. So he chose random and, and spawns Zerg, huh? And spawns Zerg, oh, yep. Okay. Well then... That's all right. Whirlwind ZVZ. Uh, I'm I'm guessing you haven't had a chance to play this map very often, as as Zerg. No, I have not. But I've okay. seen plenty of games on it. It's a very nice map for Zergs, but in ZVZ it gets kind of funky. Um, uh oh, uh oh. Wait a second. We have a 12 pool. That's not a 12 pool. That's a gas pool. I'm sorry, gas pool. What? <laughs> When do we get gas at? Wait, wait, I guess we're get, we're, we got gas like at 10 or something, or 11? I think he was just doing a 14-14, except he didn't make drones in between. Oh, oh, okay. Kind of okay. weird. Alright. But nothing too crazy. Anyway, STN going for the hatch first. And ultimately, I think the hatch first play is better here. Because it's, like, the distance is so huge. That is so far away, even for Zerglings. That's so far away. Yeah, and he is getting... You would assume he's getting fast, you know, speed. he's getting going to have speed here real, real fast. Yep, that is what he'll be going for. He's probably going to, uh, I would say, go for a speedling expand. Yeah, he's only got two drones on the extractor right now, so he's going to want an expansion after he uh, gets a, excuse me, a couple of Zerklings out, which he's doing right now. Okay, and STN did did go ahead and expand first, then got his uh, pool, and then got his gas, and uh, yeah, so everything's hunky dory right now. Uh, oh my, Zerg Prince is going to pressure hard first. Looks like. Uh, just six lings. Oh, six not, lings. Okay. Not too big of a deal. He's got four additional Zerglings being made. They're just rallied to uh, the front of his natural. Baneling nest for both players coming on the way. By the time those Zerglings find STN's base, STN will also have Zergling speed, and he'll have Zerglings of his own. Uh, he'll also have two queens, so he'll be able to defend just fine. He's even getting a spine crawler because he's not sure exactly how aggressive Zerg Prince is going to be right now. There you go, so playing the safe, just being safe with the uh, spine crawler. And uh, look, Zerg Prince just poked in there and ran right back out, so... Uh, Yep. It's good. Income tab, it's 17 drones to 14, slightly in the favor of STN. We have Banelings on the way. Um, STN did not get speed. I think he canceled it to make Banelings. Wow. Or just didn't get it at all. I thought he was getting it, but I then could have just been that I'm a derp. It's quite possible. <laughs> well, it, the, oh, using the queen to pick off banelings. I really like that move. Of course, the queen's going to get surrounded. Oh, one good baneling hit gets rid of all of those lings. But those banelings kill all the larvae that was on that hatch, which is not as important as killing units, but it still hurts. Oh, Zergling's coming in. STN really, really, really needs to get Zergling speed. He's been, he loses a queen. He loses both queens, in fact. Spinecrawler is helping out somewhat, but losing both queens, I mean, the advantage of having two hatcheries is being able to produce a lot more larvae than your opponent. Yes. Uh, STN could get speed right now. I'm not sure if he wants to save for a queen or if he wants to get his... Oh, he's moving his Spinecrawler. That's not a good idea. I really, really hope it roots. Okay, Zergling speed just started. Two more Banelings coming in right now. There are no more queens available to do any sort of sniping action. 
So STN, oh, the Banelings trade. Spinecrawler goes down. STN in a lot of trouble right now. Wow. And STN's playing. Not playing. anymore because he just hit that Baneling. Oh, ho, 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 shit. <laughs> we have BM. We do have some serious BM. Uh, by the way, STN, far ahead in workers, 21 to 13. He's building two queens again. Telling this guy how terrible his micro is. I kind of have to agree because with this kind of aggression, when you have speed and your opponent doesn't, you really should have done some serious damage by now. And Zerg Prince has not been able to do that kind of damage. We got Banelings coming in right now. Four of them in total. He's got to get his drones out of there. Oh, he's got to split. You've got to split, STN! Oh my god! Wow. 21 drones suddenly became 16. <laughs> And this queen is going to go down again. I don't think Zerg Prince really liked that BM. He's a little offended. Zergling speed finally kicks in for STN, and that aggression is going to be... Uh, but he left two Zerglings in his middle line! STN, are you paying attention? No, he's not paying attention. He, oh. he, I think he was thinking the spine crawler was going to kill him, and uh, they were just out of range of the spine crawler. They were. Blair coming up for STN. He's also going to put on some counter aggression. He's making more drones behind his attack right now. Uh, he doesn't have enough money for a second queen yet. Engagement at the watchtower. STN currently has more zerglings by two. <laughs> it's amazing. Zerg Prince is making a lot of zerglings though. I think he's going to go for another huge aggressive attack. He really has not. He's making one more drone right now. That's the first drone he's made since he made his original 13 drones. Like, he has not made another drone since the 13 was hit. Until just now. Alright, so, in other words, STN is... is what, what is his count now? Let's look, look at the income tab. It's 23 to 14. 23 to 16, I guess, right now. Yep. Wow. STN right. drone a lot more better. A lot more betterest. <laughs> Most betterest <laughs> droning ever. A lot more gooder? More gooder. He doing good. Huge Zergling oh, oh. attack coming in for Zerg Prince. STN was moving out with his Zerglings. Yes, he was. Out. He's got to be careful. He's got to use his Banelings very, very effectively. He cannot let them get picked off by a lone Ling. I wonder if uh, Zerg Prince saw where those Zerglings went either. Like, he... <laughs> may not have. One Zergling was trying to sneak in for a scout. Um, STN... Could go for a semi surround. Yeah, he could. He could. But no, he's gonna go ninja style and take his other zerglings around. When Banelings start morphing, that's perfect, SDN. He takes out a bunch of zerglings with his Baneling. He really should be attacking these Banelings before they morph. I think he's paying attention to his Ling run by, which is running into more Lings. These will be course, killed. That's going to tell him that more zerglings are coming. Yes. So able to make more himself and that is a lot of banelings that is 10 banelings from zerg prince he is mad as hell oh, and he's not oh they missed he oh, had a huge hit on the drones and there's five more on the way those banelings had every single one of those zerglings but he missed on that uh two but... banelings left stn oh five drones go down 21 21 drones have been killed by Zerg Prince. And he's running in more Zerglings, gonna... Oop. Yeah, the Queen will be able to take care of those Lings, but not before they pick off another drone. What is going on? The Zerg Prince does not does not care anymore. He's just sending Zerglings down here into Zerg their death. He's all in, buddy. He is all in. Income tab shows 20 to 24. Zerg Prince is just gonna keep on attacking. Oh no, STN! Oh my, oh my goodness. <laughs> no. It's a big oop. Oh wow. That was huge. Oh, here's the thing. If STN can stop the aggression at all, if he gets the money baneling hit, Zerg Prince doesn't have a spine at home. He only has one queen at home. He doesn't have a defense. Oh wow. So if, if STN can turn it around, he'll win the game. Yeah, so in other words, if STN's forces get to the base of Third Prince, they could be over. STN, pay attention. He lost... Uh, he did not need to trade two more Banelings for that. He already had a Baneling hit on those Banelings. If that makes sense. Oh, wow. That's a good trade. Oh. But 
Yes. Failings coming in right now for Zerg Prince. STN has got to be careful with his drones and his Zerglings right now. His micro needs to be great. Good is not enough. It has to be great. He has to eat his Frosted Flakes. He has to get his drones out of there. <laughs> He's got some Ling Micro. That's pretty oh. good for STN. He gets rid, gets rid of the Banelings for about four Zerglings. Yeah. STN with the Manor GG timing. Says this game is over. He knows he has the drone lead. It's 24 to 19. He's putting on pressure. An Idra quote. <laughs> yeah. No, you don't. Well, normally in a tournament. Oh, 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 the BM. Normally in a tournament, you don't early GG. That's kind of a uh, BM. Uh, yeah, he's BMing even harder right now. Holy crap, STN. Yeah, let's. <clears throat> I've I've learned uh, in the last couple of tournaments he can be a little BM STN. He he kind of uh, says what's on his mind. He doesn't I'm care. Hey. <laughs> kind of like you, uh, Azariah. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> oh, he's gonna beat. Whoa. Zerg Prince could have had a huge hit there. Yes. Yes. I don't know. Uh, so if you're STN, like, what's what's the deal here? Why don't you just go up there and attack? Is it because of the banelings, or is it just because you're just being a little bit careful about this? Being a little bit careful, but Zerg Prince has never gone above 44 supply in this game. STN's at 57. A couple of that's in drones. So you have to take that into account, but... Oh, SDN! Oh, Jesus! Oh, that was a painful one. It was like passing a kidney stone if you're Zerg. <laughs> T-Lad is unable to speak. Oh, uh, that's great. Although I wouldn't put kidney stone up there with that kind of pain. That was a... That was a uh... Uh, uh, notably, STN is getting Burrow. Oh, this is not a good engagement for him. He should pull back. And he, oh, baits in a hit, gets a couple, gets like six for one, not bad. But seriously, STN, you've got to do something. Get some kind of tech, get a mutalisk, get some roaches, anything. You can win this game, you know it. Oh, da -da 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 -da. No, it's, it's, uh, the reason I can't talk is because I don't need to. You're expressing for both of us. Like, your, ex your expressions are, are good enough for both. So, uh, I don't want uh, you to say anything. In the Ubix tab, no one has larva, so they can't make units right now. They've spent all their larva on lings and banelings. Uh oh, Ultimate no! Oh, that's a bad Ooh. attack to make! Man. <laughs> STN is not making. Oh, yeah, okay, he made banelings back here in his main. Okay, so that I just. Was a really good baneling hit. These banelings will need one more attack from a spine or a spore or anything. But those zerglings are gonna kill a lot of stuff. The queen goes down, a couple drones go down, income tab shows 31 to 19, STN, how are you doing this? And where's your injects, buddy? You have so much queen energy! He has so much queen energy right now, it's insane. He's making another queen. He has so much money, please STN, make a roach warn, make an evo chamber. Stop doing ling bailing the whole game, my heart can't take it. Another engagement. I mean, come on, if someone just had plus one carapace or plus one ground attack or something, the game would be over by now. But no, STN just refuses to play good. Okay, Aspire, it, thankfully. It's... I thought I had Aspire built. Mm -hmm. so I was long. all... Well, I... It's just because of that, I'm not going to give him the benefit of the doubt anymore. I thought he was going to try to rub it into Zerg Prince's face that he can win this style of game. But since he put this... a little bit of trouble now. Although he's going to get a good angle here on Zerg Prince because he was focusing the spine. The spine is going to go down. Wow. But Zerg Prince has to retreat. A lot of Zerglings coming in, though. Holy crap. This could be the end for STN. He BM'd a little too hard instead of yeah. building a fire. Yeah, yeah, so so the, the the way I felt how it was going was STN was being that guy who was like, okay, you want to play this style of game? I can play this style of game better, and doing it, just doing it just for the hell of it, you know what I mean? Oh, four Banelings lined up to get some drone kills or some Ling kills from Zerg Prince, and here they go. Drones, well, actually, most of them escape. Oh. Still 25 to 16 workers, that's not going to last too long, though. The Spire in danger, the Queen in danger, the Queen goes down. No, one queen left for STN, but no energy. The workers have to come off the line to fight. It's 19 to 16 now. But why the hell do I have Burrow? I don't know. Misclick. Two mutalisks on the way. There is no larva available. 
pressed Tien. There is not a larva to be had. <laughs> now there is, they just all popped out. He's getting mutalisks. He'll have the air superiority, but he is going to lose his second hatch. Oh, wow. Oh. Or maybe not. It's really low. It could definitely happen. This mutalisk, these mutalisks have to save the day. <laughs> Two mutalisks are going to be the heroes. I mean, if I were him, I would get plus one flyer attacks right now, since he has absolutely no larva in, at all. 15 workers to 19 now for the first time in this game. STN is lower on the worker count. I'm sure he's aware of it. But he knows he has the better tech, so he'll be able to defend eventually. I wonder if it's because he lost 51 drones so far. It could be. <laughs> Zerg Prince refuses to make more than 19 drones, by the way. There have been no drone kills for STN. Not a one. I think the sound is better now. Uh, for those of you watching the stream, I think I corrected my sound. I think it sounds pretty darn good. I think we're speaking over the sound is, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I'm loud as fuck. <laughs> no, you sound pretty good. Uh, my throat hurts. <laughs> do you have water? I do. Okay, good. I don't have another voice, though. If I lose this one, it's over. Well, the, the game, this game has been pretty intense. I mean, it, uh, a bad bailing hit either way could have switched the game, so, uh, you know. Really could have. We have the five mutas from STN moving out. STN droning up behind this, getting himself another spine. He's got enough Zerglings to defend, no problem. He did make spores, uh, that is, Zerg there, Prince. Yep, so. There are spores for Zerg Prince, so it's mm -hmm. going to be a little hard for STN to find a purchase, to find a place to do damage. Zerg Prince's main is almost dry. STN's main, almost dry. Naturals, well, let me check. The natural is actually doing a lot better for Zerg Prince because he has not had to remake 50 workers! Uh, STN is actually in range to pick off the pool. The spore crawler is too far back. So, yeah, that could happen. No more gas harvesting for Zerg Prince. He's only had that one gas this whole game. He has, well, he actually just now got that extractor, so. But the pool is gonna go down. No more Zerglings for Zerg Prince. That's it. The mutas. Uh, one muta dies. Of the six. Now a Roach Warren coming up for STN. STN has to know he needs an expansion suit. I mean, his main is basically gone. His natural is basically gone. He's getting plus one armor and plus one range for his roaches. He wanted to go take the third on the left, but he discovered that there were lings there. Oh, that's a cool effect. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Getting distracted, but... It's okay. It was sort of a cascading waypoint. Two bandings coming in! The <laughs> worker is killed! 60 to 3. 60 to 3. Uh, More Zerglings are going to pour in here, too. There yeah. they come. They're oh, they're going for the main. Cool, yep, they're going for the main. If they surround the Spire, that could be huge. If they kill all the drones, that could be huge. How about killing the lair? No, too much HP. Oh, the drones get a surround on the Zerglings. Good. That was Mutas good. Mutas stick the day. Uh, 62 workers killed. Did that change, or was that the same? 62 still. 62 to 3. Alright, STN... Income tab, 27 to 15, though. So, 27, yeah. STN still ahead. STN still ahead in workers, having to remake so many over the course of this game. I can't STN believe... STN a huge bank in gas, too, and he is getting that third. Zerg Prince, um... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> What's he doing? He's making 24 more lings, is what he's doing. Prince. He, look, Zerg Prince has two evolution chambers. Okay? He could upgrade. Could. But, but he's, he's not. But he's not getting drones either. He's getting 24 Zerglings. What, does he think he can kill Destian now or something? I don't think so. He's thought... He's done the same thing the entire game, so I can't imagine he's gonna change it now. He knows one way to play Zerg. And that is to hit the Z button. Z is for Zerg. That's good enough for Zerg Prince. These mutas are just flying around. Uh, STN needs to know where he can get in here to attack. 
with these five mutas. Um, so uh, there are two overlords out on the map if he can find them. It's like a little uh, like an Easter egg hunt for overlords, if you will. Oh, a lot of overlords right here actually that are not really safe, but there are four queens. Oh, he's gonna lose mutas. Oh, uh, okay. he gets away. Wow, he gets away. <laughs> Unbelievable. I thought one of them would go down. That one mutalist get 14 hit points. Pretty freaking low. Alright, so Zerg Prince now has a lair. Um, STN has a third base. Oh, a Nidus Network. He's gonna put down a Nidus Network. It can't right now because the Queen's in the way. Get out of the way, Queen. There we go. Nidus Network goes down. Network, and, yeah, he does have one Overlord in position. Yes, he does. It's way over here, down here to the right. Uh, there is an Overlord here for STN that's gonna spot it, it that can see that corner of the base. Yep. STN has vision, so he'll see Anitis should it start. Yes. Hmm. So once he sees that Anitis, I'm sure his mutals will swing around. He's got roaches chilling at home as well. They're 1 1. Do they have speed? Yes. No, not yet. They have creep speed. That's what I was Sir. saying. Sir, you were going out. Uh, Alright, we just lost uh, Azariah. I'm going to uh, hang up the phone and then he can call me back then. Uh, but uh, yeah, so anyways, we have a lot of roaches here for STN, the uh, <laughs> uh, Nidus Network does go down, he's gonna lose it, Zerg Prince is gonna lose his Nidus Network, and if you look at the supplies, guys, uh, I don't think, uh, Zerg Prince, with that loss, oh, there, there we go, GG, and, uh, yeah, so GG from, uh, 